Symphony of War, the Nephilim Saga, the new DLC is out, I think yesterday it came out, uh, the Legends DLC. Now, this adds in, um, if you're not familiar with the game, it's it's a JRPG kind of thing where you're going to be raising an army and, and moving these armies kind of across the battlefield. It's kind of a quick-paced thing, and I would not put myself in a um, in the boat of JRPG fan, but I've mentioned before that there's, there's a couple that come along the way that I really like. And when I played this one last time, this is one of those that uh, I really like. Um, and I've been looking forward to an excuse to come back and play it again. And, and we have an excuse now because the DLC is out. So we're going to try it out. We're going to try out a new game plus, which allows us to adjust some things. Um, we'll skip the uh, like the early little bits and I'll kind of sum up for you. Because like all JRPGs, it's wordy. Lots of story in the beginning. We will skip. I will explain so we can play the game. So we're going to do a captain mode. There is a new ludicrous mode here. Um, the fan, the the devs apparently are fans of, of Spaceballs based on this what is on the Steam page. Uh, we're not doing that. We're gonna go camp mode. I'm gonna turn the tutorial off. Permadeath, but I'm gonna keep on. So we're raising armies, right? And and as my units, if they die, normally they come back at the end of the fight, and you get them for the next the next one. Um, I don't like that. I want to be able. To, I want if they die, I want them out of here. So we'll leave that on. Let's uh, begin the game. New game plus. With the plus, we get to choose a lot of these little things. We get a lot of little things we can change around. This is something that comes along with the DLC. And um, most of it, we're going to kind of leave it as it is. Fresh start, you know, I'm not going to do a head start or anything. Like we're just going to go into the game, um, beginning of the game, and kind of work our way into this and keep it most mostly as is. I'm going to change one thing, though. And that one thing is Dawn of the Risen. So enemies will have an increasing... No, um, yeah, yeah, there we go. Enemies will have an increasing ability to, to command Risen as the playthrough progresses. Yeah, fine. That's fine. I want I want to see Risen in here because have, I also have a chance myself to become like a commander of Undead. I could be a necromancer. We'll see. I think everything else is fine as it is. Enemy power will... No, no. We'll leave all that as it is. Advanced AI. More clever and ruthless. We'll leave that off. Let's begin. All right, so I'm going to skip ahead here so we have this big world map and there's three big empires we're in the big empire the biggest empire and there is a rebellion this this guy with an eye patch i don't remember his name came in and like stole the princess away and he's like threatening to march on the capital well we me being in command with old zelos here um have been tasked to go put him down before he does that so just to sum up for you uh when i played the uh when it came out i played this same one before, so we'll skip a lot of the story bits, and I'll just sum up for you. So, the way this kind of works is, it runs by armies, and so this is my army, there's me, along with a healer, and I got a couple swordsmen with me, we got Zelos over here, he's got a couple bowmen with him, and the whole game plays out very quick, very fast paced, where each one of these things are different armies, and we just march the armies around individually. Our goal here is to go and seize East Wall Fortress, which is right there, uh, and we have to do it in, I think, like, how many turns is it? In 11 turns. Uh, we have, if we attack from a hill, we get, we get bonuses with our archers, all kinds of little things like that. Um, a, a big part of this, if you're familiar with like ogre tactics, then you're familiar with what the game is like. Um, but each of our units, like those two swordsmen, the, the healer, they will be leveled up, and and we can like, um, we can change their classes almost like um, Sands of Salazar, you know that kind of thing where you can you can adjust all that stuff, and you can really sculpt your army, and that's. Half the game is is sculpting your army, which I find fascinating. So anyway, we're going to grab old Zelos here. He's got a couple archers, so we're going to bop him down here. He's going to go ahead and attack that fella. He's got a range because he's got archers. So his archers can put off a little shot. Pew, pew. And there they go. Because they're archers, they get to shoot back. But we have weakened them a little bit. So then my melee fella can come in here. Me, I mean, can come in here and uh, smash this fella. And it's all kind of like, I don't want to say auto-battler, but... I'm sure there's a, there's a term for this that does not call it auto battler. I'm not sure what it is though. <clears throat> sculpt your army like if you feel yeah yeah. <laughs> no no I no this time I sculpt. Uh, we can't really see much um, about that. We'll see that after we get out of this. We'll see how that all works with the with the army sculpting. Um, I think everything else has been we're kind of in, in in baby mode. So once we get through this phase, we'll we'll move it on. I'll speed up the combat as well so we can get into there. This guy's coming to attack me. Since we're in melee, he gets a swing, I get a swing, he gets another swing, I get another swing. 
and then over. So you don't necessarily all die. We have a healer who's throwing a heal on my guy, keeping me alive. Remember, permadeath is on this time, so if if he dies, he did. And the hit points stay, um, stay there. Like his 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 injuries, I should say. We're gonna walk into Kallenberg here, because this is our job to go and seize this place. This is the rebels have taken over there, this rebel scum, and, and we're going to claim it back. And now Mr. Eyepatch, General Antares, he's he's angry because we have we have arrived. He's sending out Wolfgar to go put us down, but he doesn't have any depth perception, so I'm sure we'll take him out just fine. Alright, the rest of our army has arrived. Alright, Sybil and uh, Jules are here. Hey, you rebel scum, she said the same thing. Uh, so, uh, what what Jules is saying is that Sybil's squad is front soldiers, which is teaching me how to use like these, how to use armies, basically. And it's telling me, you know, put your archers onto the hill so they can go and get a little bit of a boost and attack at three squares now because they're three because they're, they're on a hill. Hey, Skull, how's it going? Yeah, we need healers. Healers are pretty important. From what I understand. Um... Every round getting getting like a heal in there is pretty helpful. Uh, you can see we get these exclamation points. They want to talk. Talky times between between uh, missions, or actually during the missions, I suppose. Oh, his name is Darmok. Darmok? Sorry, buddy. It's Tanagra all over again. Star Trek jokes. Where's my where's my human the uh, sound bite? For my people. Right, we're marching forward. Uh, I don't think we do. We need to heal anybody. Oh yeah, we'll we'll heal um you. you. There it is. There it is. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Skull. Anyway, I got through like the first couple of these things, and I got when I played this last time, I just got to the like, juicy bits of like sculpting my army and, and leveling up and all that kind of stuff, and I really want to see it again. So we're spending the day here, uh, just to see how far we can get with this and, and what all we can what all we can do with it. And apparently, I'm not sure how much the story changes, but it makes it sound like you're not necessarily always the good guy, depending on what you what you choose. And I'm always up for that. Um, so they're too far away to shoot, so we can go in like... Um, if I put you there, I don't think I can walk... Can I, oh, I can walk through you. So I'll go there. I'll, I'll just do a little, uh, a little shooting. There we go. She's a healer, so. Didn't do as much good. But it did us a little good, because he can come over here and attack. Healers are great. She's like a little, little bit. She's like a hero healer, which is why she's so special. And she surrendered. Hey, level up. Those those uh, things that just popped in there are like are like resources that we'll get whenever we build our armies later on. Uh, I want to go in here and turn that up. We'll go to fast first, and then we'll see what happens. What was that what was that? Show combats. Oh, hmm. interesting. Oh, so like if it's not me fighting, then it'll show the other ones. I gotcha. Um, I'm kind of in the way of where these archers would would normally be because I can't I can't stand. If I come in here, I can come in here and swap places, but then I then I lose my turn. So I'm gonna say, just you get in there and just hit that guy. Yeah. On a bridge. Okay, level up all around. And now we should be able to come over here and stand here and finish these guys off. Hey, there's some free iron. I love nerds to do this, so we'll, have to, we'll boogie in here and get those sparkly gems. Shoot me with your arrow, it's not nice. Um, I'll go ahead and clean these guys up because they're just a bunch of archers, they shouldn't be too hard. ground nothing okay let's go step into this iron mine here and seize that 
And you know what? It has a little bit of a... I'm sure there's other games that would be a good um, example, but... Like, here's my magic, you know, when you go and you collect these resources, and you're going to use these in the overworld for building up armies and all that. Come over here and march over there. Are you the are you the archer guy? Oh yeah, let me put you on this hill. There you go. Okay. My eye is very itchy. What does it mean when your eye is itchy? Like when your nose is itchy, someone's like thinking about you or something, right? Or maybe that your ears, I don't know. What of it means you're you're gonna get money. I hope it's that one. Uh, let's go over here to this one, and then attack from, uh, the hill. Oh, they... Are they on a hill, too? Hmm. I'm just getting started. Can you do anything? Um, you, why don't you park over here, and then just heal... Heal these guys. <laughs> let's get, um... Come on over here, and uh, and get that fella. Almost got him, and then I will come clean it up. Call me the cleanup crew. With my blue hair. Well met. Here with the Imperial. Oh yeah, so I walked by next to what's her face, and so I can talk to her. Hello, Sybil. She's a battle maiden. Um, she's sent up here to come come uh, flank him. That's an impressive title. But you wear the garb of a temple priestess. Yeah, so what? Okay, so we're gonna have a little chat with her. Alright. I guess we can talk to her as well. No. Yeah. We'll do it later. Can you make it all the way in there? That'd be nice. We got him on the run now. River Fortress is ours. Yeah, it is. Um, me saying, he's yelling at people to go out there and stop us. Okay. Counting on me as army leader. Well, you know, I'll do what I can. Go, uh, step in there and claim that place. And then, I guess I'll take the front. For my people. For my homeland. I'd like to, well... Here comes Sybil. Ready or not. Sybil, can you come stand here? You have, oh, you don't have any archers. You have archers, Jules. Why don't you do attack? Take the guys out in the middle. They don't have any archers. Bridge is a choke point. That would have been a good idea. Would have been a real good idea. Yeah. I must stay strong. Would have been a better idea than what I did. I'm going to hit these guys because they're archers, and I think I can probably smash them pretty good. Look at the old backstab going. I almost got them all down. Um, just spears. We can go over here and, and throw some spears at these guys. Did you, uh, surrender? Nice. Okay. We gotta claim that over there, too, before we get out. Oh, my archers. Oh, I lost an archer! I left my archers just wide open. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, no. Good. Good. Apparently I got a bandage out of that. That was almost... That was bad. Come on over here. And then... You guys aren't feeling so hot. Can I go ahead and take these guy out? I'll we'll probably need to, like... I'll we'll probably need to, like, work together or something. Come over here onto this hill and attack this guy. Does it matter if I'm on the hill, coming down the hill, charging? I'm not sure if that matters, but we took him out pretty quick. I'm just getting you. I really just need you to heal. So our, these guys are pretty bad. So he's all beat up. You see, he's got this guy's got a... I don't know if you can saw that. One of them has, like, a silver bow. I think they're a little bit... Yeah, that's... They're an archer captain. We will always find a way. Um... I need you to come over here and deal with this. Maybe we'll let this guy come over here and grab this. You just stay there. What's that? Where'd you see that? Yeah, turn seven. We got it. eleven. Is our is our goal? 
It's kind of what I was wanting. I really can't send you in there because you're still beat up. And if I go in there, he's got archers. He's going to shoot back at us. It's going to be real painful. Um, I have time for to do this one more round. He has archers too, doesn't he? We'll just do this. I think they're okay. They'll be okay. Whew. Hurt. Okay, so now I can get in there and start hitting people. Man, that backstab's nasty. If I go here, can you heal my healer? Okay. Um, I'm going to let you just kind of come over here and then we'll reclaim this thing while they're doing all that. Because you're kind of beat up. Now I'll take down one of my swordsmen. Okay, well, we got him. Ooh, got a cloak. Okay, step in there, claim that. And I will step in there and claim that. Take, take the other objective before you kill that guy. That one, you mean? Rank S. Alright, so we got some money, and we'll use that money to go and, and increase uh, our, um, our army. So, this was just sort of like the outskirts uh, going into the fortress, which is what we're trying to do. I guess that's the princess that he captured, Mr. Eyepatch. Uh, gotta escape to a centurion's rest, he says. Uh, the, yeah, yeah, Florina, that's the one that uh, that, he, that he captured. I think I'll just willingly go with you, says Florina. You will. Uh, we both know that the snakes in the capital can't be trusted. You're much safer here, away from their schemes. And Terry's, you're gonna get yourself killed. You don't deserve this. I'm gonna give him my life, but so too will my men if we do not escape immediately. Go to Centurion's Rest. Uh, sure. Oh, my last one. I uh, will just put up that one. Okay, we'll do that one then. <clears throat> There's our map. So we are up. We're up this way. We're at East Wall right now, and there's there's a uh, like a, a rich desert folk down this way, and there's a like a tech advanced folk down here in the island. We're sort of the empire, or whatever. Uh, I mean, this rebellion begins away on Nook's minds. Not an invading force, but common people. Fellow, fellow Viridians were fighting. If Antares is brought to heal, there can be a quick end to the violence. Yeah, good thinking, Nook. Okay, so now we go into the part of the game we could spend a lot of time doing. We got a bunch of resources up here, and as we claim things like the iron mine, we got iron that we can use to organize our army. And my army's a little beat up at the moment. Let me um, first level up um, this guy. If I remember how to do this correctly. Um, operations, that guy. Unit status for Christopher here. Christopher? Okay. He's a guardian. Uh, we've got like, so in my squad, we got a capacity of 53, and these guys are all taking up 28. So we can add some more folks in there and and um, and, and make a bigger squad here. Uh, what kind of artifacts did I find? Yeah, I got a fancy cloak. What's the cloak do? What makes my Aurive? Or Imbued with magic. I get plus six magic if using that one. And the bandage gives me plus three capacity on my squad. I don't think I do any magic, but the, the priest does. So I'll take a bandage. And then the priest was um, Sybil, I think. We'll give her the cloak. Okay. Oh, I can wait, map sprite. Okay. Um, 
There we go. Okay, here's it. So, so Christopher has leveled up, and as long as we have the resources, we can upgrade him to something different. Like we can change him to an archer or to a spearman. Um, and what item do I, what item do I have? Ooh, I got a Mark of the Risen. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and what status is that? I want to change class for him. And he's a he's a fighter right now. We can make him a soldier or a spearman. If he had one more strength, he could be a soldier. I'm gonna save my money on this guy. Look, we can make a big archer squad. Let's go buy somebody. Let's go to the market and let's recruit some folks. So we got a uh, we got a a medic, a level one bowman, a level one militia. A level one fighter. We've got a level four spearman. So the these guys are like mercenaries, and so they uh, solely motivated by, by payday. They uh, um, they're plus two capacity space, um, unless they're the leader. And then Ephraim, because they're really good, but they're expensive. I'm gonna hire uh, Frederick and Hugo. I'm gonna change their names. And I need another soldier for my front line. So we've got a fighter and a militia. This guy's quite a bit better, I think. He's basically better in almost everything. The only difference is this whole water, earth thing. Affinity, water, gorilla. Bonus hit innovation when standing in rough terrain or on offense. I think my squad's going to be just like the tanky ones. So we're going to send in the fighter, Zephyr. And if I think I can probably afford another one because the capacity for these guys is something like 10 each one. And so we'll have Oten in there as well. Get my money up there. Trader, we can go and buy healing attunement. Being healed, the effect is increased by 50%. I can buy iron. I can buy a spell book for like my, my folks. A staff. How to combat healing power. Okay. What do we sell? We can sell our junk. During Use during squad organized to summon persistent risen. Well, let's see about that. Make a new squad. We're going to do some squad operations. So in my squad, I want to add in you two. Yep. Zephyr, you take the middle. And Oten, you take the side. We have two available. Next, we've got... Um, we have an archer. I wanted to put the archer in Jules' squad, but I might actually just combine them. Like, can we just say... I'm going to put you in there. Um, we can disband Jules and put her in the Zelos' squad. Uh, that's me. Those are my... Um, oh, they might be they might be forced there. Because these are like the main... These are the heroes. So let's put it in... Like, Jules is kind of alone here. Let's give Jules just the Archer squad. You get Hugo. And you can have Frederick who can hang out. Uh, he'll hang up. Well, I'll put you there. Can I move you around? You go back. You go there. Okay. Okay. And it looks like he's the only one that actually got to level up. So Christopher here. I guess I can make you a spearman. I wasn't really wanting to make you a spearman. Can I change me? Can I change me too? Interesting. I'm a strider right now. I can be a captain or a cleric. Huh. Uh, okay, let's bring in. I don't know. Do I make him? A, do I want to make him a spearman? Let's hold off on that until he gets more resources. Then we'll make him something fancier. Okay, so there's our squads reorganized. Tech tree. We've got. Some tech to spend cost two of those things. So let's get a uh, recruitment spot for apprentices. We want non leader units and squads now gain LDR at a mod modest rate. What's LDR? Leadership. Leadership. Uh, enemies get a moment penalty when they move into uh, near us. Support classes get 20 maximum HP. 
Cavalry squads won't have any of those yet. So each unit gains three weapon power for each unit of a different type added to the squad. We can now target the leaders. All new conscripts are at a plus one level with half class mastery of their starting class. That sounds pretty good. I'll take that. Does it affect the ones I just bought? Now construct crossbows. Unlocking the crossbow class. Uh, grants heavy infantry and heavy cavalry. Heavy infantry would be cool. Proof steel plate armor grants our heavy infantry and heavy cavalry plus five armor. Uh, let's do... Let's just give 20 health to my support classes. For the other tech that I have. Because I got two of those. And... I think we have a chat going on here. So rela relationship... Nothing to talk about here. Okay. And conversations. Nook and Jules. Uh, hey there, hey there, Jules. Yeah, these, so these are like the four main characters, basically. Oh, hi, Nook. Pretty relieved that you and I ended up on the same team. I'm pretty relieved. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not sure if I would have made it through archery without you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Lucky break. Lucky break. What's it been like growing up in Viridia? As a, yeah, so you were from... Um, one of the other places. A wondrous place. Okay. We have a lot of chats. A lot of chats. Good artwork. The whale back there. It's good. Look, look, looks good. I think they changed the portraits as well. Oh, we became friends. Excellent. What about Sybil and Jules? Let's have another chat. I see that whale over there. Let's go chat. So yeah, good thing they showed up. You helped out. Good for you. Uh, we need to give some of you some soldiers back because we lost some. Um, actually, I could probably buy a couple more. <clears throat> I've seen the girls in the Sisterhood of Justice. They're so amazing. Uh, what do you want for your future, Jules? Well, I uh, haven't thought about it. Okay. Give me some stars. I guess nothing we can do here. I guess I can my friends and who, um, family and all that. Um, I want to go check something real quick. So you have, you have space for like two more people in this squad. You can afford one more in yours. We can get one more archer. So let's get a, um, let's get an archer and I guess we can do two archer squads. Right, Archer Squad. Archer Squad. This guy doesn't really seem to fit in the Archer Squad. What's in here? Nothing. So yeah, let's get a um let's get two archers. Or maybe Zealous would just be sort of be an all around kind of guy. We'll give him like a couple spearmen or something. We'll make him everything. And then two and then I think we can get one archer in here. So we can buy Tibost. Are you level two? Oh, you are level two now. Oh, I should have got that first. Uh, and then we can get two guys in that army. So I think I'm going to like have a bit of a blending of things. I'm not going to spend the big money on these guys. Maybe I should. Um, we'll get a medic in there. And we'll get a uh, another frontliner. All right, I'll buy it. Ephraim, I'm buying you. See if I can afford you in here. So we want to add in Archer. No, not Archer here. Um, Rogue. And Healer. Doesn't matter where they. I wonder why it matters where they stand. There we go. That's per that's perfect. Does that matter where they stand? I'm not sure, but we'll do that because it looks kind of neat. And then the other squad can have another archer. I'm going to move you to a side. And we'll add another archer. Old Tibost here. Tibost. I wish I could change the name. But I can't. It doesn't matter where they stand. It, well, should I? You can move them on half tiles as well. Is there anything like I should... I'm not sure how, how that matters. Just where they attack, I guess. Where they get attacked from. Let's do that then. What does that matter since some attacks attack lanes and columns? Okay. Okay. Well then. 
slide you in like that. Do something like that. My army is 19 of 250. A lot of people we can have here. Okay. Next mission. I should look at Legends, Legends chapters and see what that is. Alright, we're too late. Our base at Marenberg is under attack. We don't have time to rest uh, rest up and, and catch up. Go save that base. Okay, there's my base I gotta save. Um... We got what? Okay. Well, if I can get um, archers, Stay strong, everyone. you can come stand on this bridge. Oh, you can't hit from there. But you can hit from there without getting a hit, right? Yeah. Throw some throw some arrows in there. Nice. And then. The hill over here. Yeah, that would work too, wouldn't it? You could go here and then do a couple hill things, but it doesn't really matter because it's sure. Finish them off with your with your arrows. Done. Okay, and then healer. I'm gonna put you on the bridge. I don't want them coming in here and, and chewing on you. You're not very tough. Uh, what's my mission here this time? We've got C's Marsh, March, Trade Town, Denari in 11 turns. March. Uh, Denari. Let's see, Trade, trade Town? Is that must be this? Marenberg. And we gotta go save, save this guy. Maybe get some cavalry over there. Leave my horses alone. Oh yeah, my archers aren't. Shouldn't be staying in. Oh no. Oh, they're raising the dead. My army shouldn't be standing up there like that. My archers. I left. I should have put them right there and let, I filled that gap. Whew. Rookie mistake. Now they got dead things. You can't attack them. Uh, why can't you attack them? Okay. A lot of pluses. I should have put them on the hill. Let's go take this guy out. Archers can finish that off. He will always find a way. Hey, surrender. Okay, now you aren't the really the toughest. There's not much there to deal with, so I think you can probably handle that. Hey, spooky. He could come over here and chew on these guys, I suppose. Uh, can I move you yet? No, because you're just an ally. ally. You just kind of do your own thing. His morale is shattered. And he ran away. Eleven turns, I suppose. Uh, hey, 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 buddy. What's the world coming to? Will you save my hide now? Well, at least I can do Barnabas. Okay. Honor to fight by your side. Everyone change the roof. Get the paint out. Blue's our color now. 
So we can go and claim this and then come around, I suppose. Or we can come around this way and worry about those guys later. Problem is getting... It's a decent amount of, gr of folks over there. Um, well, we gotta claim that. Anyone, like, severely wounded? That guy kind of is. Claim that. Um, I want you to stand over here and then give him a heal. Because they got whooped. And then these guys got extra whooped. Yeah, we'll go we'll go over here. We'll um use the hill. We'll see. They may come down this way. Hopefully they stay up there. And we can go this way. Ooh, he's got some moves. Let's see what happens. Fire Emblem and, and uh, Ogre Tactics, is that the other the other similar thing? There's Chad over there. We got some my Milan. Oh, no, no shooting from there. All right. I'm not sure whether we want to be in the trees or or um in in the road. Just go here and wait. Come over this way. Of course you can go over here and like start hitting them. Light infantry, I think I would think. Light infantry versus cavalry, we should be able to mow these guys down. Yes. They have been thoroughly mowed. Oh, we can keep on moving. Um, do you have it? You don't need to heal anybody. You're good. Here comes Sybil, ready or not. Ogre tactics. Oh, my archers! Archers are getting slaughtered. <laughs> I keep forgetting about my archers and just leaving them to get slaughtered. Oh, man. Oh, was that Julia? I'm sorry, Julia. I don't like... As long as I don't die and Barnabas doesn't die. No, it's okay. We didn't like Julia anyway. Light inventory. The horse is going to take this guy out. I want to raid skellies in my army. Mark of the Risen. Hang out over there. You, um, I don't think you're in position to, like, handle that. So, go claim this town. I, however, can probably handle this guy, but I think I'm going to go in... I'm going to hang out in the trees and see if that makes any difference. And she's not very tough, so we're going to move her, like, over here. <clears throat> Did you hear about, uh, about Uranus? Planet Uranus? They finally changed the name. Now it's called Eurectum. Sorry, the jokes are just going down, just going downhill. Just, just going, just going downhill. <laughs> Is that a Futurama joke? Oh no. Is that where that's from? <laughs> they have two archers, so it means if I were to shoot them with my archers, which I did, um... Like, I can come over here. Well, no, I guess I can't reach him. Um, I'm, just getting started. I'm gonna let you claim this thing. <laughs> Those heavy guys are gonna be a little tougher. But my cavalry are nasty. And I can move out of the way so I can keep on fighting. Yeah. Let me at him. Let me at him. They killed Julia, my favorite. Or Julie. I don't remember her name. 
she was my favorite. Now my archers can handle him. They can make it over here. No. And that hill wouldn't do it either. <coughs> oh yeah, I'm dropping some frames. Jewels, jewels, jewels. Yeah, I could spend. I could see spending a lot of time um, tweaking armies. Definitely. I was dropping frames. I don't, I'm not dropping them anymore. <laughs> it was that, that embarrassing defeat um, for my, my rangers. Look at here, a bunch of horsies. Uh, are those those are light cavalry? Light cavalry sounds like they would get whooped by heavy cavalry. I gotta deal with that guy up on that roof there. But we can't if we go clear out this guy off of the roof. Off the stairs, I mean. Well, they're a little tougher then. Well, we got a couple of them down. Um, yeah, let me just get back and let me come in and finish these guys up. Like, I don't know if... Spaz, you may know better. Should I fight them in the in the field, in the grasslands, or should I fight them in the woods? Um, I'm assuming I'm going to fight them in the square that they're in anyway. Oh, man, we whooped those guys. Okay. Woods matter if, if I'm on defense. Okay. And we need healed here. No. Just wait there. Sybil, come on in over here. Sybil really likes your name. Yeah, this, this is probably gonna hurt a little bit. Oh, we got a healer though, so we're okay. Those are heavy cavalry. Um, deal with these guys. That's a pretty good squad. I think it's a nice, a nice balance there. I like that. I think I'm, I'm pleased with it. Um, I think my cavalry versus theirs, I suppose. Jules doesn't have much that she can do. She's got spearmen, so I'm sure she's going to help defend. We'll throw her in these woods, just in case. Um... I think I'm gonna let the horsies handle the horsies first. Because then we can get out of the way. Well, that was no problem. Okay. What am I worried about? Um, if you can keep on moving, why don't you come over here and we can claim the stables. We can start making our own units. I'm going to let you just go grab some things. Do, we need you? Do I need you for Klaus? I might. You can want to handle Klaus all on your own. Just come hang on to this bridge. I'll clean this guy up. What turn was it? I didn't... I wasn't paying attention. Turn eight. Okay, we may have time to do this. Think we can do this? We, the, um... The mission was... 11 to win it. I think we get it. We get a, a bonus... If we do it in 10 turns. We can try just him on his own. Up here, you think? This guy can make his way up there, too. We got we got one more turn. School is in session. I must stay strong. Get to there. If she gets there, she can get the stables next turn. I think one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. No, she's gonna be one short. What do you think? I don't think I'm going to have time unless the cavalry comes up here. I don't think I'm going to make it. I'm not going to make it by turn 10. I'm going to make it by turn 11. Hmm. 
I don't know. If I were to kill him before the end of the thing, does it does it does it give do I get the reward of having these things? You know he wants to go there. I can get the temple, which I need to get the temple in time anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and go to the temple. And then she doesn't do much good. She's not gonna make it there. Well, maybe she will, because she's in a forest. Maybe that's gonna slow her down. I don't think so, but we're gonna try it. Oh, they're spearmen. I didn't pay attention to that. Sorry, Klaus, I wasn't paying attention. You have spears. This is gonna hurt. Ouch. Ouch. I should really pay attention to this kind of stuff. Um. You just stay there. Oh, that guy's nasty. Okay. Mistake. Big mistake. Maybe we should have split up. Like you were saying. You can't make it there. Man. I want to... I want to... I want to redo. <laughs> that was nasty. I didn't pay any attention to them being spearmen. Well, I gotta claim this one. Cool. Um, over here. And you're gonna go over here. And I got one horse. He's gonna die. Barnabas didn't survive. What happens? Oh, before being rec recruited. Okay. School is in session. Even though they would have chased me. Hey, Pink Fizz, thank you very much. Oh, they don't chase. For my people. Okay, well, I'm coming back. Claim that. You get that one. <coughs> um, you guys don't have a heal, do you? Yeah, just come and hang out over here. I don't love what happens. We didn't make it. We didn't, we didn't get the, uh, we didn't get a prize, whatever it is. Oops. There. Come on over here, buddy. This one here. Do I have to use it? Um, can I use it between? Like, can I do it now? Revive. Ah, look at that. Oh, that's great. Too bad my archer squad's dead. Um, I think this guy's gonna handle this. Yeah, they're pretty good. They got it. He's big and mean, and and but but we're not on horses anymore, like like morons. What kind of moron would attack a, a heavily armed spearman army with horses? I don't know. Some people just don't know what they're doing, though. Um. Okay, come on over here. It's all it's all over. We got everything. You just sort of hang out. Nothing for you to do. <coughs> Walk on in there. 
A little slow. I guess we don't get as much bonuses or whatever. Reach Centurion's Rest. Fall back to the keep. Prepare final defenses. Don't R. Save us. Pray his own dignity. We need to get like an artifact or something. Rank A. It's about as good as it gets. 20 years ago, Imperial Army Barracks. All right, Barnabas, we've got another one. You get your men organized and ready to deploy in two hours. Another Denari Temple. You have a problem with that, Sergeant? That's the guy on horseback, right? That we just revived. No, the army's been put to good use, sir. I'm sure you think so. Try to clean that uh, uniforms up a bit before you men shut the place down. The war's over. Public eyes, eyes, and everything we do. So there was a the part of the story was there was a big rebellion. Um, I think like the king died, and so everyone kind of fought a bit. But then the princess reunited everything. But there was some cranky people like Mr. Eyepatch. Okay, not enough coin. And uh, go do it yourself, he says. Yeah. I can do it, sir. Oh, there, small fry. Is that me? It's all right, I'll leave. Don't sweat it, kid. Get on home now. Your folks are probably worried sick. That is me, isn't it? I can tell by the hair. Hoping you had a home to go to. Let me clean your uniform, sir. Ain't got nothing to pay you, kiddo. It ain't worth spending the energy. It's okay. Please, sir. Supplies in the basement. Maybe the shields could have, have a bit more shine to them. Lost my appetite, too. Guess I'm gonna have to take my lunch so I don't... So it don't go bad. Nothing special, but it fills you up. Well, thanks, Barnabas. I assume that's me. Um, sure. Can I save it on that one? Everybody makes its final stand at Centurion's Rest. Centurion's lost most of his forces. The compound is heavily fortified, will not easily fall. Now we get to go into the castle, I think. Uh, Prime Minister Casimir, who's been a contender for the Imperial Throne, seeks the prestige of a victory over the rebels. He has arrived outside of Centurion's Rest with the Imperial Army as Nook's force prepares the final battle with Antares. Peace may soon come across the land. Alright. Uh, Jules is back. I guess she comes back, but the, the, the units don't. Um, I don't have a lot of stuff, but I got horsies now. So, like all these guys we got here now. Um, like Christopher here. Christopher, can I make you... Uh, I can make you an archer now. It's an apprentice. Apprentice is a magician. Fires... Launches a fire elemental. I want to make you an archer. Cavaliers, cool. I want to make you an archer. Christopher the Archer, yes please. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I did not mean to, I didn't mean to do that. That's not what I meant to do with with Archer with Christopher. Um, I was thinking something else. Um, but um, I do want to change class. What about? Um, you over here. Can I make you... I can make you a priestess or a siren. So a siren launches a dark elemental magic that has a chance to stun or daze. Priestess is a standard support. Healer. Acolyte. Provide healing in and out of battle. The ability of cavalry. No, I make you a... Uh, dark magic sounds exciting. I want to, Yeah, do some dark magic. Your points go down, weapon goes down, but you got magic. I should give you that cool cloak. Uh, there's Christopher. There's me. Uh, there's my other fella. So I want to make these guys uh, soldiers, not archers. I was thinking it's, I had a different person. So soldiers, what I want. Well, you're going from a level four fighter to a soldier. It gives you more strength, more more armor. Uses one of my resources. There we go. And then we've got Zephyr here. Can I make you a soldier also? Do I have some of that stuff? Oh yeah. 
make you a soldier as well. Okay. Now, anyone else level up? Now, anything I can do with, with you, Jules? Oh, I can. I can make a Warbow Powerhouse Archer Unit. Or just a regular old Bowman. I don't have the stuff for that, so I can't make you that one. Okay, I'll get you some more archers. I keep killing them off. It's rough. Joining the uh, this this squad as an archer is a rough a rough task. Move. Um... So I think what I'm going to do is I think I might well, I think I might switch this archer and move him to a different squad and put another melee in here. So I'll have dark magic. I'll have me and I'll have a line of of footmen in front. I think's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna get another squad of archers. I think I can I can fit four of them in there. So let's get uh, Shatner. Another siren right there. Uh, Mark. Ethel. There's four, and then I'm gonna bring in. I'll bring in um, Andrew. To fill out my my line. Now. So I'm going to move him around. So Barnabas is with us too. I can get some, get some horses. Um, actually, let's go ahead and do that now. Let's take to get a horse. I think I just have to, re I have to upgrade him, right? So I can just... I can get anybody and then put him on a horse. So we've got a line of cavalry. Let's just get, like... Let's bring Heidi and, and Seema in. And then let's see if this we can do this. So Barnabas here. I want to add in Sema and Heidi. I can't upgrade them right now though. They have to be. Can I change you, Heidi? No, you got to be leveled up before you do that. But I'm gonna, I want to make you as soon as I can. I'm not a hospitaler. No, you can't name him. I wish you could. I really want to. Music is so exciting. Um, I'm gonna remove Christopher. I'm gonna. I'm gonna add Andrew in there. Okay. Archer squad. We're gonna add in. We're gonna get Christopher in here. And we'll get Mark. I wonder if I should put somebody like. I wonder if I should put someone frontlined. Hey Naza, how's it going? Get some sleep. Um, it takes eight to put someone in here. So it might be a good idea to put a, a melee guy because they're just getting whooped. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do. It. I'm gonna, I'm gonna position them correctly. And not get them all killed. See how it goes. Is that everybody? I've got one more one more archer over here. I don't have a home for. I can't really fit him anywhere. I could probably rearrange a few things and get him and get him in there, but it's fine. Um, now on on me. So change class. I can choose me, and I can change right. I can upgrade myself to a to a heavy soldier or a cleric. I lose my strength, but I gain some magic skill, and I can start healing my folks. That may be better for me, because I've got a line of tanks, or basically tanks, damage dealer, and then I can have a little bit of healy. I mean, I'll do that. I like the whole jumping around and smacking people, but... Yeah. I'll be a cleric. Strider was the one guy was jumping back there and like stabbing people in the back, but yeah, let me, let me do some healing. Okay, we'll see how that goes. That, they might get whooped, and Barnabas might have a trouble as well, but if we can level people up and get them on horses, we'll be better. What's this? Now we got chats. Hello, Barnabas. Remember me? We're out here doing what we prepared to do for years, I say. I haven't been seen battle since you were a street urchin, Nook. I thought I'd pick up the sword again, but it feels like a warm hug from Mother. Can't put a price on that. 
Uh, how am I doing? Uh, you don't know what you're doing until you wake. You're walking the tightrope between life and death on the regular. Okay. Okay. Uh, memorize the street urchin. Nah, it's a bit a little foggy. Showed up at our barracks shining as bright as a star, and I cleaned your shields. Okay. Okay. Uh, fight through that doubt, kiddo. Thanks. We'll go through all of them. We got, uh, Zelos and Barnabas. We can skip these two. Yeah, we'll skip them. They're becoming buddies. There's some, uh, ribbing going on. I think the, the archers cost eight, and there's only, I think, six, uh, space available. Little Barnabas is having a chat with everybody. Quite the talker. What about these, uh, relationships? Hmm? No? Okay. Oh, yeah, tech tree. Uh, I got three of these to spend. Target leader attack type. If we get, what is it, four of these, then we can unlock recruitment slot for apprentices. Sure. And then non-leader units and squads now gain leader at the modest rate. Buy oh, exotic artifacts. Uh, I like crossbows also. There we go. There's Grant's heavy cavalry. Which we'll get as soon as we can. We'll see if I can do it right now, actually. No, you got to be leveled up before. I don't want you to be a hospitaler. I want you to be a like a cavalry unit. How do I get that? Will you guys be knights when you get leveled up? Cool. Okay. You guys are all... You can be knight. Oh, okay, so once you go soldier, then you can go up to a knight. Okay. You'll be able to go to, like, a sorceress or an oracle. Okay. I got five space. Yeah, and they they take eight. Even if it was a disguise. Six, so it would still be a little bit too much. Items do I have? What does this do? Granted from ter terrains is increased by 50%. Damage reduction granted from terrains. Hmm. Sure. Yeah, you can have that. Uh, did I do it? Yeah. There you go. So now you get a bonus there. I want this, I want this, uh, this whole, um, I want this skull. Use during squad organized to summon a persistent risen. I got a skelly. Um, can he, can he fit? He's, he's the same size. So no. Well, um, what's your name? Andrew, get out of there. We'll put Parsa in there. What was it? Rename scroll. Oh, uh, look at that. Okay. You want to be in my squad? You shout it out. Don't hit enter. Okay. All right, there we go. <clears throat> yeah, Twitch integration would be real handy, wouldn't it? Okay. Um. Uh, what's Legend Chapters? It means we're four to unlock the promise of peace. Okay. Let's deploy. Am I bothering you? Uh, Nerus is zealous. Let 
think these people are common thugs. What I believe doesn't matter. We're just soldiers right now. I don't know you're better than that. What exactly do you think these rebels want? They don't know what they want. They're angry and confused, lashing out against order, hoping chaos will improve the situation. All they understand is force, a force they shall receive. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What do they want? They just want to be heard and understood. The Empire is taxing people to death and to pay for the succession war debts. If we destroy Antares, others like him will continue to speak out and rebel. You know as I do, an army of lambs can become lions at a moment's notice. The throws reversed. If you were the one begging for mercy, do you think you, you would get it? Follow orders, it's our duty. It makes everything so simple. There's a Crimson Star out tonight. I haven't seen one in a long time. It's an omen. Yep. Every time we've seen the Crimson Star, something big happens. Really big. It starts speaking to us. Calling us to do as, as Ontinti would and fix this world. Ugh. I say. That's probably what it is. Good chat, buddy. Good chat. All right, to Centurion's Rest. You just about clean this up. Yep, uh, Army of Antares is broken. Should be a trivial matter to finish the job. Yes, the people of the capital are anxious. They crave swift resolution. Prime Minister, they've dug themselves in deep. We're reckless in this attack. We'll risk unnecessary casualties. Yeah, we did a lot. Look, was it? You made a bit of a name for yourself. Someone in the army ranks speak of a teal-haired youth who shocked Antares with a dramatic move and put his rebellion to a quick end. Commander Trian, does he speak for you as well? I must I summon a bit more patience to spare our men? What are you talking about? Defenses are formidable, for your excellency. A more cautious approach would save lives. As you wish. Make sure that Nook makes it through this battle intact. I see great promise in him. Thanks, buddy. Hey, T Kitty, how's it going? Army's been vital to our operations so far. We're going to need shock troops. Break in there. Okay, yeah, we can do it. Okay. Back him into a corner. Nothing to lose. They've got nothing to lose. Chapter 3. Okay, get there before the Imperial Army. Why? You want mercy for the defeated? Don't you? I can tell about the Crimson Stars got me on edge. I got a gut feeling. Use that excuse a dozen times with me. True, Nook. Maybe we can convince them to lay down their arms. Let's show Casimir's army who the real elite vanguard of Viridia is. Okay. We have quite an army here. I'm controlling these, this group here. These guys, I think, are, are running on their own. Um, but we have some archers to deal with here. I'm not going to send the archers at any spearmen again this time. I'm not doing that again. We just charge in there and start hitting them? I think we're going to go sit my archer squad there. Attack. I can take out other archers. I'm going to mow these guys down first, and then we'll work our way in up upstairs. Ooh, good guy got to level up again. Okay. Attempt to negotiate a surrender. If the attack fails, enter combat and lose your first turn. We'll make him surrender next turn. That's another way of making them surrender. I'm hoping we can get those guys leveled up and we can turn them into uh, knights. He can probably hit me from there. I'll back up a bit. Now, I don't want my archers to get mauled. So I'm going to try to protect them. You can make it all the way over here and hit my archers. I gotta protect them. They might shoot at me, but they'll shoot back. So I'm gonna go here. And she can stand in the middle. Can you heal a skeleton? Oh, you can do a lot of stuff already. Here. 
can I do this? Oh, I can just affect these guys. Okay. 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 Whoop by those guys. No, my archers! I didn't see the horses back there! Ah. Oh, nice. Nice. Are you gonna come do it too? Well, oh, we lost two of them. I wasn't playing on archers. To come. Man, I just can't. I gotta put someone. I gotta put a, a soldier in that, in that squad. Yeah. And now they go again. <laughs> oh, man. The whole squad gone. Man. Okay. Okay. I really want to have a good archer squad. But it's just, it's just not going to happen. All right. Um... I'm gonna go over here. Well, that's a little demoralizing. You got good morale. Ooh, ooh I'm getting more and more skellies every time. Nice. Uh, now, uh, uh, can I? Because you're dead. I'm gonna form a squad with these these two. Yeah, I don't really care about that. Okay. Um. Yeah, you go take this care of this guy. What's how's he feeling? He's probably feeling pretty good. He's he's at fair. We'll go try to we'll talk him down. Actually, we'll take these guys out first. come over here and look at these horses and say boo chance none maybe I shouldn't have done that Ooh, one swing that guy's nasty is that zealous for some reason the skeletons didn't want to surrender now let's take a look at them they're shaking will it tell me like say I want to do a surrender they're shattered. Chance max. There we go. Oh, we still get this. Okay, still get the stats for it. Cool. Man, I just need like I should grab um one of my um one of, just one of my shield guys that's in my squad. Stick them in that archer squad, and maybe they'll last a little longer. Fair. I'm gonna move. Um, I'll put you in there to grab those gems. Just three over here. They're both fair. Is there a chance? Ch chance, none. Okay. Well, they just hit him then. Take out, the, take out the horses. Take out poor Benny.
Oh, even with my inventory, I can still move. Okay. okay. And then I'm just gonna come stand up here. Yeah, we're fine. Does the uh, does the game scale on number of units that you have? Cause I could spend I could just spend a whole bunch of money make make a whole bunch of different squads and send them in here. They'd be kind of low level, I suppose. Or is it the same thing no matter what you got out there? I'm assuming it's gonna stay the same no matter what. You guys are a lot tougher than I am. Surrender, buddy. Do my skellies stay stay with me and they keep on leveling? Give me my horses up there, and then we can just have them surrender. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. He's in good shape. Let's go ahead and grab that. What's my my quest here? No allied Imperial Army units, squads lost. Ugh. We don't have it like a temple this time, right? So we can't do any any resin. School is in session. Now, can you force them to surrender? They're they're in good shape. So no. Alright. Probably gonna kill them all. This is my fight. Unless he has a spear, so I'm not gonna send the, the horses in there. Horses will go and grab this. Yeah. Let's go grab that. Uh, put some archers in there. They got some crossbows. Ooh, the crossbows are nasty. Oh, yeah, yeah. We do have, so there's an ability we can do where we can focus on the leader. And I can see that be... That's the way to do it. Take out the leader, then morale drops. Oh, somebody died. That's no good. You can't heal them. You're just wait there. You got kind of whooped there. Yeah. 
He's gonna hurt. Do I lose? <laughs> yes, died. Okay. Um. Okay. Let's let's try that one more time. Man, he hits hard. Okay. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I got it. Man. Okay, where's my skip button? How are we going to hit that guy? Well, you know what we're going to do? We're not going to get our archers dead. If they can get a shot in there, we'll be fine. But we're not going to get our archers dead. I'm going to say it again. How do I do that? I'm going to make a like a wall here. And keep the archers... Maybe the archers can... Yeah, okay. Archers will go there. We'll hit these guys. Oh, his, his morale is already shattered. Let's just hit that guy then. They're going to hurt. But if his morale is already shattered, then we can come up here and, and scare him off. Okay. Level, level ups all around. I can even... Can, I wonder if we can just go there and plug that. I'm going to stay right here. Okay, and then I'm going to go here. I'm gonna heal my my friends, who's sort of a little hurt. But that way the archers don't destroy him. Okay, and then this guy's gonna go plug this hole right here. She's gonna stay back here. She'll be fine back here, I hope. I'm gonna keep it back here. Well, she's not that. She's got some spearmen. do like the they know who to go who to go for we're that healer though she's pretty tough why can't my archers do that because I got spearmen in front line Ooh. Certainly going differently than last time. Music. It's like we just like blew up the Death Star. Uh, he's fearful. My archers can probably. Oh, they can't quite make it. Can archers do the whole um, the whole scare them away thing? No. No surrender. Cannon melee, okay. Makes sense. We can shout from a distance. Hey! Surrender! Probably no chance on that one. Oh, I got. I didn't see Chad over here. Hey, uh, let's try it. Chad, give up. Okay, 
Yeah, that's what we need. We need we need level ups for my arm. I need a good archer squad. Okay. Oops. These green guys, they just hacking and slashing. Last time, um, I didn't have permadeath on, which was one change, but um, my squad, I remember with me, was real tough. I don't, know, I don't remember what I had, whatever I had on it, but I remember really taking anything out. This guy's kind of in the way. Hmm. I, to, I could go over here and switch. Let's go. Yeah, we'll go here. Scare him away. No surrender. I want to shuffle with this guy because if I shuffle, I don't, I can't attack. So I'll just come stand over here. Grab that and come over here. Green guys are tough. I'm assuming we're, I'm guessing there's a chance we're gonna be fighting them in a minute. If, if things are going as I as I think they go. Well, maybe that was dumb. Okay, we got some shattered folks. Let's go move around here and force them to surrender. Cool war pike. Can I make it up here? I can't quite. Stay strong, everyone. Oh man, they sit so hard. Why so hard? I didn't expect that. There goes my archers. I'm on a mulligan. Those crossbows are nasty. Of course, my guys are all like, you know, like they were pretty low level because they keep dying. I'm going to die again. Because the green comes in and saves me. They got skeleton bowmen. That's cool. Oh yeah, they're up on the yeah that the height. Only one guy with a spear. Maybe the maybe the horses can't handle him. Uh, 
actually. How are you feeling? You are real bad. Um. Grab that. I'm gonna let you do some healing. They're done, they're just gonna stand around. Yeah. Hmm. We can get another heal. How many turns do I have to do this in? This is turn six. I need this done in seven turns. So I can like move them up there and shoot. Their archer's gonna just mow me down. Um I guess she can come up here like that. Heal him. They're gonna get whooped. What's what's your attack range? No, I didn't. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, wrong button. Well, let's do this. We did this before. I didn't do it. It's any good. Other than giving us levels. I come in here, he's gonna kill me if I go in there. In I'll try to hit him with horses? He's not gonna surrender. He's a big bad guy. Like a normal attack. Just do some damage to him. That's, that's some damage. Now there's more of them. Weaker. This is the turn I have to win this on? Maybe. Um, I like. Well, there's three of them and, and two of them. Who do I want to shoot with? Does shooting even matter? I'm, I'm going in. Probably a bad idea, but I'm going in. If I go in, then no one else can go in. I can go in and then, like, swap. Maybe keep keep me alive. The horses are all beat up. Can I do it with just me? If they weren't all wounded. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try a shot. See if we can get them, weaken them any. But no, it just gave them more hit points, basically. Man, how am I going to do this? For my people, for my homeland. for. They can come stand in the way. No, they can't. I'm dead again. I blocked my spot there. If you come here and you shuffle, then I think my turn's, yeah, turn's done.
I'm done for. Again. How am I supposed to do this? Man. A dad joke. This is no time for a dad joke. Rush him. Rush him with what? Power of a dad joke. Man, I saw so there's this bunch of guys I used to know. And um they uh they all thought they were like exceptional at statistics. Well, turned out they were just average. All right. Let's see if we can do this. I don't like my chances, but I'm, we'll see if I can do it. Um, For my we'll go and, and scare some people away so that they, they surrender. Get out of here. Don't you know when you're not wanted? We'll scare everybody away. You don't want it either. Take that, Chad. Okay, I'll back up. Uh, I'm not moving my archers in because they're going to get swarmed by horsies if I do. Um, I can go stand over there and wait. Archers. I suppose they could stand there. They might get mauled by them, but whoop. I'm worried if I put them on the hill, they're going to come around and get me, so I'm just going to hang right there. I'm not attacking that. And then you, uh, you got spears, so you just stay right there. Okay. I know, every time one of my guys dies, they put an, a skeleton in there. It's nasty. We don't get, if whenever we make them surrender, we don't get skeletons, do we? We only get them whenever we kill them. Which makes sense. I'm raising their bodies. I'm gonna come in and try to stab me. We got spears. Spears and heels. I keep going for the spears. Maybe that was part of the uh, AI intelligence. Or they're just trying to get rid of us. Close. I'm just going to let the green guys handle the archers. I don't need to handle them. They're both shaken. Can you come over here and shake it may not may not get him a surrendered. Oh yeah, Max. There we go. Okay, I think I want I must stay strong. I want to kill these guys. Because killing means skellies. Aha. Okay, you just come over here and hang out in these trees. Anybody need a heal? Uh, mostly just you. Heal yourself. Okay. Uh, horses. They're both in good shape. I mean, we could do it and go get some some hit points or some. Um, oh, you got these guys too. Yeah. Attack that guy. And then we'll just move up over here. Green guys will clear all the archers out for me. I don't need to worry about that. <coughs> so 
I think I'm going to try Archer Squad. Post him on that spot. The only thing is, we can, I can have... I can have... Um, I only have one range unit, one melee unit. So I guess maybe I don't go in there. Maybe we put in the healer with the spears against him. Archers and the spears in front. Shoot my horses up. I'd rather they not do that. My horses did do pretty good, a lot of damage there. So maybe the horsemen stay in front. Hey, Benny. My skeleton's getting better. It's great. Are those like those are persistent skeletons, right? They're going to be there forever. We want to attack this guy or this guy. Let's get the guy on the bridge. Capturing that one. Oh, you're all fair, huh? We'll take these guys out pretty quick. Whenever my skellies die, can can he res skeletons? I wonder. Two healers and free future squad. Okay. Here, go ahead and heal yourself. Me. I'll move up here. I'm gonna get him this turn because I'm gonna have to get my archers in, in place. He will always find a way. I'm just getting started. Um, we'll just park her right here, and I'll go ahead and grab this. I think the horses might be who I have who I send in there first. Can I save right now? Quick save. Okay. Now, um, bef I think I'm going to do it kind of like all in one... Well, I can't do it in one round because of the way that um, I can't stand in the same spot. I could try sending this guy in and, and pick him off a little bit, but it doesn't really do any good. He just heals through it. 
I'm wondering if he can't heal through the archers. Okay, you just hang out there. What a rebellion you got there, buddy. This is where I will quick save. Okay, so we want archers there. And we're going to attack. Maybe get a little healing in there also. That's not much damage. Now, we can move the horses in, they can attack, and then get out. There we go, we got one dead. Oh, God, one died. But he didn't res him, so get, get out here. Um, you can, you can come over here and heal. Heal that fella. For my people, for my I could go try to do it, but I'm like a little worried. Do I go for it? I'm gonna wait one more round before I go for it. How are you feeling? I'll heal you up. Because he's gonna hit these archers. I guess I could save and then go for it. You're right. No, I can't. I can't. Um, I have to cancel his move. Now I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. You have one more heal. Uh, no, just save that one heal because we might need it next turn. Okay. He's gonna shoot my archers. They'll shoot back. Hopefully, no one dies. He gets one shot. Archers are just not, they're just baby archers. They're not good enough for crossbowing. Oh, almost. Oh, we got one. Nice. Okay. Okay. Well done, archers. I knew you'd be good. Uh, let, me, let me heal you up. I'm going to heal you up. Okay. And buddy, do your shooting. Oh, he's fearful now. I'm gonna, should I go mosey on in there? I'm moseying on in there. He's shaking. We can try to force surrender and see what it says. No chance of surrendering. All right, we'll do the old fashioned killing. Okay, got him now. Okay. Why is no on top? That was nasty. That was rough. Because he's big boss man, though. Take that! My dark magic. Did we do it in seven turns? I wasn't paying attention to the seven. Oh, it's turn eight. I should have gone for it. Hooray! One too many turns. It is a win. Yeah, if I attacked last turn, I was too scared. And Terry's all these men had to die just to fulfill your delusions. Good men were wasted. Florina, hang tight. It's almost over. Uh-oh. Someone's getting stabbed. Florina, I failed. Just let it in now. Turn yourself into these into the people. No more reason to fight. 
I will die this day, Imperials, but I will live on in the hearts of those who have been betrayed, who walk this life a stranger in their own lands. You Imperials have forgotten us, those who bled for you, those who now toil for you, but the people are beginning to see. And when you finally push too hard and plunge my homeland into chaos, those who survive will remember you as traitors. What are you doing? Don't do it! Oh. He says, pray his own tinty as he stabs himself. All this for what? Made a defeat and died with honor. This is different. There's a chill in my bones. All this sentiment, sentiment over a relic of the past, it escapes me. We have like music like blaring the whole time and all of a sudden, silence. Too silent. Zelos, what's going on? Stay calm, Nook. Nook, Zelos, must congratulate you on your victory. Your key role in dispatching of the rebel in Terez is noticed, noted. What For that, you have earned our gratitude. He's clearly a bad guy. Gratitude will serve you well in what's coming for you. On behalf of the Empire of Aradia, you are hereby guilty of high treason and conspiracy to murder the Empress. Yes, we've heard of your plans for treachery, Nook, and so too will all of the world. That's not at all what. This is some kind of joke. Troops, you may fire when ready. Numbing poison. They are to be kept alive. Oh, my blue hair. Nook, what have you traitors done? Face me, you cowards, says Zelos. Get him, Zelos. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh. Imbeciles, we discussed this. Don't cross blades with that one. Shoot him now. I wish he was that tough whenever I was fighting with him. He died a lot. Ugh. Is that all you got? Casimir, what's going on? My Empress, it's a relief that we were able to uncover Nook's plots. Rest assured, the traitors will be dealt with. It's something else the matter. Why would... Shock me as well, but I, the, uh, a head of state naturally has many enemies. It is the way of politics in this age. Let's return to the capital and put all this nonsense behind us. All right. Man, I didn't see that coming. Florina, assigned as a child the privilege to sit on the Imperial throne because of the blood relation that barely qualifies as legitimate. A high seat above all the world. Does someone like you even appreciate the power that it emanates? Someday, this land will have a leader that gives it the reverence it deserves. As you breathe, you die in breaths. Take solace knowing that I will take great care of all the people in this land. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Betrayal. Prime Minister Casimir has Nook and Zealous taken alive just before assassinating Empress Florina. Using his position, he blames the murder on the Denari Temple's meddling. Unimpeded by the stinging head of s by a sitting head of state and newly bolstered by the victory over Antares, Casimir strengthens his position as Prime Minister. But neither of the th neither the throne nor the Empire's strongest noble houses are under his control. For too long, the great dukes of the Empire, Terranor of the uh, of the Duchy of Remorg, Lothair of the Duchy of Isanter, and Yaramir of the Duchy of Imbor, all issue public rebukes of one another, claiming the Empress's murder was a political plot to attempt to gain control of the Imperial throne. Florina's uncle, Terranor, sends his army to his forward base of Fort Eureka as a show of force. The fate of Nook and Zealous remains a mystery. However, fortunes turn in Nook's favor as an unlikely hero arrives just in time. Who is it? Seven years ago. Remember, 
recognize that hair anywhere. Don't you guys have anything better to do? Where'd you get that uniform, says Cadet? You been stealing from the armory? Street urchin? Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. What should we do with a thief? Are we gonna go crying to the Master Sergeant again? Yes. I'll be watching you. If I had my way, kids like you'd be sent home. Yeah, go home. I hear the back alleys are comfy this time of year. <laughs> Get out of here. Just you wait. I'll be general and, and, and imprisoned, and I'll come back and stab you. You okay there, Nook? Hello, Zellos. I guess so. Don't sweat those guys. I've seen you in class. Not enough brains between the three of them combined to make one of you. Thanks. Blink. Zellos, uh, there are supposed to be my... These are supposed to be my comrades. They are. When it comes down to it, we're gonna bleed for each other. We're testing you. You gotta fight back. Doesn't matter who, you always gotta show the world you're not to be messed with. I could take... You could take these guys no problem. If I helped you, they'd never leave you alone. Just trust me on this one. Even if you get roughed up, roughed up, it'll pay off in the end. What's with the blinkies? Something might happen to those guys later. If anyone asks, you had nothing to do with it. See you around, Nook. Oh, my. Okay. Are you gonna murder them, Zelos? Chapter 4, Paradigm Shift. A little more zoomed out here. It sounds like these that I asked myself, what a, what went wrong? How did the likes of Stefan end up against the, these devil worshippers, running the risk of bringing harm to his beautiful face voluntarily? Oh, well, these prisoners likely won't be saving themselves. Oh, we're in the temple. Just you? Okay. Bet you didn't see this one coming. Get him. Yeah. What do you do? All right. Um. Well, I just think I just sort of sit here. Stab this guy, see if this guy cares about this. Oh, nothing, nothing to see here. Just your friend getting stabbed in the back. Oh, sorry. Did you need something? Someone up there likes you, friend. Let's get you out of those chains. What's going on? Oh, my name's Stefan. I'm working for the temple. Thanks, Stefan. I'm Nook. Can you swing a sword, Nook? Well, I hope so, because these cultists are hot on my tail. Let's find a way out of here, friend. I think I saw the exit around the corner, just northwest of here. Northeast? He's in northeast, northwest. Ready. Yeah. Look, they gave me a sword in here. I want that chest, though. Bet you didn't see this one coming. We don't have much choice. We can either be, we can be blue hair boy or blue hair girl. That's our options for character creation. For my people, for my homeland. I got a chest to open. <coughs> At least they gave me an altar to hang out on. Thought me nice of them. I figured there'd be some coming in here. Hell's bells. Covers blown. Gotta get moving, kid. I must stay strong. I gotta get in this chest. The battle life before me. Treasure. Ooh, money, money, money. I love this part. Come stab this guy. How far did he move before?
Oh, that way. Okay. Ooh, look at all that treasure. Getting real thirsty here. Thirsty. Okay, you clear the way. Hopefully this guy down here isn't going to, like, slaughter me. Oh, I have more stars than he does, so... I'm not scared. I don't know that I want to attack him. Oh, there's another one. I'm not scared, but I don't know that I want to attack him, because he kind of hurt. Yeah, heal myself. Okay. Let me probably get up here. He'll get on me. Um, I can run in there and get him. I want that treasure. But there's treasure to be had. <sighs> All right, fine. Oh, Stefan, how are you planning on getting by the blonde with the giant hammer? That's Diana, our ticket out of here, my partner in crime. Diana isn't the leader of the temple, Paladins? Why would she be here? Let's have a meeting of the minds of the leader, Nook. Okay. Oh, yeah, against... Oh, she ran in and then turned around and whacked him. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah! Good. She got them under control. I'm getting that loot. Yeah. You know when you play those D&D &D campaigns and sometimes the DM just, like, throws in... Like, he has these story characters he throws in and they're, like, way too powerful. You're like... What am I even doing here if you've got people like this that are cleaning up all this place? I, f I, I, f I have that feeling at the moment. <laughs> for my people, for my homeland. Bet you didn't see this one coming. Um, you stay here and like keep the coast clear. I'm gonna go and, and um, well, I'll heal myself first. And I'm gonna go get that treasure. And you just sort of stay here and guard those stairs. Okay, can I move you? Oh, I can. Uh, well, I'll just stay there and Maybe I can. Hmm. Yeah. Getting real thirsty here. Yeah, you just stay there. I'll just move out of the way and let her handle these things. I'll go open that box up and get me a bronze arena token. Um, I mean, I'll, I'll go stab this guy, I suppose. Prisoners here? Uh, yep. This is fortunate. We did not expect this. You must come with me. Okay. We go down there. You want me to go over this way? For my people, for my homeland. I must stay strong. Do I move for now? Real 
of Thursday here. The battle lies before me. A paladin never surrenders. I don't know. Yeah, we can just sit there and just keep on getting infinite experience. I don't know. I'm assuming because there's only one of them. It's not a big fight. I'm assuming it's not going to be that much experience. I'm guessing that's, what, that's all I need is to get there. Maybe not. How do I get out of here? Mm. Where do we need to go? What do I do? Hmm. For my people. For my homeland. Paladin never surrenders. I must stay strong. I love this part. Uh, you have a problem here. What do I do? Escapes from prison. How do I get out of... Maybe I need to go that way. There's arrows there. It's got to be there. I don't know what it wants me to do. We can see some of the new legend stuff now because we are at level four or whatever. Granheim Abbey is just over those mountains. It's a Denari temple outpost. There will be... We will be safe there. Keep moving. Cold does not take us. Enemy patrols will. Am I the only prisoner you found alive? Yep. Where is Zellos at? And he's clear, uh, clever and elusive. Hey, corrupted. Uh, I am um, possible you take your, that your friend was taken elsewhere. What do you mean? Long story. Of course. Welcome to the Abbey. Maybe these temple folk are crazy enough to want to live here, I suppose. Uh, I gotta admire the grit. Let's speak in the chapel. It's a miracle that we found you when we did, Nook. Who are my captors? Followers of Xanatus. 
and my mortal enemies scourge to the innocent people of our world. Xanatos. Yeah, that one. Some call him the Devil. Bringer of Death, Dark God, what have you. Turns out he's got quite the following here among us mortals. A cult of sorts. They might have taken you away, never to be seen again had we just been a tad slower. Have you heard of the battle between the Dark God Xanatos and Donar? No. Story time! In a time long before living memory, the world was covered in despair. The Dark God Xanatos was summoned into our world, and the human race endured unspeakable tyranny and hardship under his rule. Seeking to liberate their people, five warriors led by the legendary hero Donar rose up in rebellion. Donar became the symbol of hope, and for the first time, people believed that Xanatos could be defeated and they could be free. On the brink of defeat against overwhelming odds, the five heroes received the boon of the heavens. With this new power, they pushed back the demonic forces of Xanatos, and Donar plunged his blade into the heart of the Dark God himself, sending him to the void. He tossed a ring into a volcano also. With the defeat of Xanatos, followed by the collapse of his empire, the human survivors, guided by faith, planted the seeds of civilization as we know it today, and prospered for centuries. This ancient battle is about to return to our world. Everything has been set in motion as it is told in the prophecy. This is why the cultists have been mobilized. They are searching for the, the Nephilim. Nephilim? You mean the giants in children's fairy tales? Five heroes who defeated Xanatos so long ago ascended to the heavens to watch over us as the gods. Spirits have seen fit to return to our world to be reborn into five mortals, five Nephilim. We of the temple have no doubt war is coming and Xanatos is marshalling his forces against us. Anna, are you going to tell him, or do I have to? We did just witness you in battle. What are you supposed to... Wait. Uh, what? Are you supposed to be one of these Nephilim or something? Nephilim come back with blue hair. Prophecy is not so easily interpreted. The Temple Grandmaster Oxley believes I bear the characteristics of, characteristics of a Nephilim due to my lineage. But you were the only survivor we found here. They know something about you, Nook. That makes you part of the prophecy. That's... Come on. Nothing special about me. I'm just on the wrong side of Casimir's scheming. If you expect me to just listen and believe... You need not simply believe. Look. This is a runic pattern des designed to channel certain energies. This more humane version is used by the temple. And mine. Every prisoner had this inscription. Evidence of cult experimentation. To fail their test is to die. Yet, as you live and breathe, you stand before us. This can't be real. Listen, Nook, if someone tells you you're a god, you say yes. Pretty out or asks, sorry, asks if you're a god. Pretty outlandish stuff, eh? I try not to question it. Makes things nice and easy. What would you have me do? Normal to resist your fate. I cannot force you to do anything. All I ask is that you put your trust in us and all the Denari Temple, your newest ally. You are now known to the followers of Xanatus. They will be coming for you. I have a small army here in Granheim Abbey. If you would join us, we are planning to return home to our main temple at Lemelin. You saved my life. My little flashers have turned yellow. Only as far as your home temple. Zelos could still be out there. We gotta find him. <coughs> my friend, if you and I are truly Nephilim, I will never leave your side and no one will stand in our way. It's the fate of Nephilim, left Nephilim to reunite as one or else all may be lost. No friend of yours will go unsaved. No enemy of yours will go unpunished. Uh, of this you have my word and my honor. Hard to argue with that. I requested the, that a force of temple warriors be assembled for us. Let's meet him. Sister Diana, I hope we meet your expectations, and we have more than enough supplies to make it safely home. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, wow! Is that a girl? 
Of course, Abigail. Thank you, sister. You are to serve our new friend Nook during our journey. Sister? So pleased to meet you, Nook. Yes, I am a priestess of the Sisterhood of Mercy. You look so familiar. Do you have a brother? Good one, good one. Ah, uh, yeah, I certainly do. Ah, yep, you're a mirror image of my friend Jules. Only a sibling of his could be so sunny. Jules is a guy? Jules died a lot. Triple exclamation points! You know my brother? How fortuitous. If you are a friend of my brother, you are surely a friend of mine, dear Nook. If you will have me, of course. Sure. Yeah. So with this, uh, with this DLC, we get a bunch of new new classes as well uh, that we can level up to. With the cunning adventurer Stefan and the mighty paladin Diana as Nook's new allies, Nook sets out from Granheim Abbey, bound for the Denari Monastery at Lemelin. There, he hopes to gain the answers he seeks. Nook will have to reach Port Janus, from which he can sail directly to Lemelin. Where? Janus. Oh, there. Where's Janus? Oh, I'm way up here. Okay. But now, Nook, must, Nook faces the followers of Xanatus, who seem to have far-reaching power and influence. Seems that Nook's moment of rest will not last long, as the enemy has seen fit to call for reinforcements of its own. Do I have an army? I do have an army. Hey, look, and it's the same, it's the same army. Just Stefan and Diana are in it now. Well, she's got a double healer army. Okay. Okay. Can I, uh, I can get people? I can. I can make that ar that archer army that I so badly want. I got some money. So, Bert is going to be in the front line, and then we're going to have a whole bunch of archers. Bert, I think, is like, like 12, so we probably can't get a whole bunch of archers, but we can get a few archers. I'm guessing I can get, I'll see if I can get four. I'm not sure if I'll be able to. Let's exchange. Oh, we can exchange things. Okay. So I went to, I went to um, form a new squad. Let oh I got a whole bunch of people hanging around here. Oops. Oh look, Mike Andrew's still around and and Spaz is still with us. Oh okay. I'll get two squads then. Um, so Bert, you're gonna form a squad here, Bert. And um, Bert, I like your name, but you're gonna be um, oatmeal. There you go, Devious. Leader and loyalty. What's unscathed do? Enemies cannot critical hit this unit. Yeah, I want him to have that. Can I give him this too? Oh, this guy just kind of pops in there. Um, like, it might be kind of handy. Oh, you know what? I'm not sure. We could do one of those guys. I want him to be in the front and then archers in the back. Oops. And then we're going to add a bunch of archers. Anybody we know? Everyone's level two. Uh, women is, is five. He didn't have much of a capacity because I guess he's not much of a not, not much of a leader. I only have eight more and I can't get anyone else in here. That's not much of a squad, is it? Not much of a squad. Oh, as 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 loads increases, their cost decrease. Okay. Um. Well, there's another squad here. Nope, you're in there. You're gonna die pretty quick, so don't worry about it. I guess we want someone with good leadership. Which the best is gonna be uh Spaz here. So let's make a new squad. Led by New Squad. Can you not do it? I might not be high enough level. So you will lead it. I'll put you up here. I'll put you on the side. Okay, we'll add you back there. 
We'll put Andrew in the front. No, we can't really afford anything else. I mean, that's going to be it. So it's kind of a... Oh, no, you can do more. Marcus can hang out back here with you. Okay. Not, not the... Not the greatest of units. Squad. But we'll see how it goes. Okay. Can I... Oh, I can add someone else in my squad, actually. So I will take an archer. Uh, let's take Shatner. Oh, it's plus two. Never mind. Okay. All right. Take two. Anything? Anything to spend here? I got five to spend. How do I unlock these? Unlock two more with tier one techs. I'm gonna do that one. Slow him down a little bit. And I want to target the leader. So now we can get crossbow and rangers gain additional bonus damage against other folks. Arrows fire. Plus one arrows fired. Yeah, you know what? I want I want arrows. Aggressive or cautious attack. Squads gain morale bonus within the three tiles of a base, village, or town. Do I have any more? I got one more. These each cost two. I'll take that one for some leadership. Okay, and we can chat. <sighs> Hello, rogue with a heart of gold. How are you? How are you? Um, okay. Now, we can do this one now. Promise of peace. 25 years in the past of War of Viridian succession is at its climax. Captain Antares takes point in a critical moment. Sure, let's try this. This is a new DLC thing. I want to see it. That's what we're here for. 974, the Denari calendar. Continent of Viridia during the zenith of the War of the Viridian Succession. Empire of Viridia has long maintained a diffuse... A, dif a diffuse... Diffuse power structure? Seeing its vast lands and resources governed by multiple powerful nobles, officials of the Denari... Uh, Guildmasters... Okay. Emperor fell. Emperor died. Emperor uh, Empire fell into turmoil. Started as small disagreements, became a revolution. Okay. Opportunity has risen. A hero has emerged from the ranks of the Imperial Army. Captain Antares. I'm about to lose my eyeball, aren't I? Oh, yeah, we have an arena token. Also, we can do that. We can see what that is. So this is a side mission. Lord Godfrey was never going to let this happen peacefully. Ooh, that's a big one. I gotta get there. Must reach capital here. Be on guard. We can surely expect more resistance than we see now. Or we don't face his elite arbalist units again. They have proven quite deadly. Florina, I dread the idea of bringing... Ch bringing... Of a bringing... I, indeed the, I dread the idea of... Bringing a child to this battlefield. But you must know that these men are coming for you. Stay near. Okay. Like, aren't these guys all my... Ah, okay. Oh, and I can put my people in there? Okay. Sure. My two... There we go. Okay. Info. Arrive at Armitage. Armitage. Don't die. I mean, I mean we may not be, like, in a good situation for this battle because... Maybe, because it is, I guess, level four. So we can start doing it. So we'll try it. Uh, what's in there? 3,000. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm pretty tough. But if I go up there, I'm going to be all alone. You got a good squad. They're going to come through the swamps here. I'm just trying to get to that. Let's just get there. Like, no need dilly-dallying around and goofing off. I'm going to go ahead and just... Let's take one of them down. Uh, now nah, we're just doing a long attack. I think we'll probably kill them all. Okay, back up a little bit. The rest of us will come up here and join you. Uh, Diana, you're pretty tough. 
You wait right there. Yep. Uh, Mr. Rogue can hang out kind of behind here. Me and my Skelly's gonna hang out over here. Oatmeal's not much of an army, so he's gonna come up in this way. Skerez will come in behind. Yeah, you level them up, you give them items. There's artifacts out there as well. We've seen a couple of those. One of my... Uh, I guess she's not with me anymore. One of my... I bet I gave it to her. I should have I kept it. Um, which, one of my uh, healers has... Actually, it may be Spaz actually that has it. One of my healers has a, a cloak. And then I have something also. Wait, can you go there? I don't want my horse is there. For my people, for my homeland. Where am I She's in bad shape. Oh, that's a rogue. Oh man, they're tougher than I was expecting. I'm gonna put her in this and let him let her heal uh, that guy. Oh, I should heal myself. Oops. There we go. Okay. Treasure over there. Trying to lure me away. Ouch! Ow! Man, that hurt. Yeah, I was worried about that one. Ugly fight. You don't have any more. Oh, you do have a heal. Um, okay. I want I want to come over here and get this guy because I'm gonna get some free skellies out of it. Okay, this guy's in real bad shape. Uh, bad shape. Yeah, you're shattered. We'll make you surrender. <coughs> Man. 
man. Ooh. My, uh, my. That's what I mean. My defensive, my stronghold here isn't, isn't strong. And they're all rogues. Man, they do some damage. That's why my cavalry's eating through them, because they're, they're just rogues. I guess I can come clean this guy up. Dang rogue. Try to get some more skellies. We might be maxed out on skellies. I'm not sure what the rule on that is. Oh yeah, and then we get the next level. Okay. Oh yeah, we can make a massive army with skellies. Okay, cool. Um... Just make him some random. Oh, he's in good shape. Okay, take that guy down. No spears. I'm not sure I'm going to get very far here. Um, yeah, you can stand here and kind of block that spot there so they don't die. And then... We get a first attack. We can probably kill him. We'll go for it. Are they are they like breaking? They're shaking. So maybe we can just go there and just scare them off. Chance low. Okay, well, let's just kill him then. One good hit. There we go. This guy's in real bad shape. He needs to be down here getting healed. No more heals, huh? I do I have a healer? I don't. I do have a healer. You go there and wait. You go here. And heal these guys. Um, there you go. Can you heal... Just hang back there and just kind of take damage. Three turns to get, yeah, to get two turns up to get the. It, it was at six. My skellies! Well, these guys, are, these are the tough guys. Yeah, I think we might be a little tougher before we did this, this mission. I think we did hold them back. That's those are the um, like the elite troops. Nice heals. And healers are really, yeah, healers are really powerful. We need a healer in every squad. Can you heal first? Oh, you can't, you can't heal and attack. Oops. Um, yeah, that's not good. Oh, two healers from melee squad. They're gonna come right here and they're gonna kill them. What good is that going to do? Hmm. Just come around here. Yeah, just, just, just wait over there, and you just kind of wait back here. I think because he's in melee, it's going to take a, like extra time, extra time units to get around. Let's see if it, if it affects him. Rogues. Maybe not. 
Maybe not. Ooh, we won. Now, I got that Mark of the Risen. Can I give it Can I give it to her and fill this, the squad out? <coughs> I'm sorry. Um, organize. So, where is she? She's in this one. No. Okay. And these guys aren't, aren't ready to go out there. Okay. Can I use an item? Or... Only these guys can use them? Okay. Alright, well we got rogues in the trees. These guys, we got these guys not in trees. So we're gonna go to the, the, the not in tree guys. Horses are nasty. Yeah, I want to use the Risen. Hang out there. Can I make it there? No. I don't have any range. Let's go over here. I should have probably got a heal off. There's a, um, I knew, as soon as I put her out there, I knew that was a bad place to put her. Um, it's like a, you get rewarded for, for do, completing it at a certain time. For my people, for my homeland. Okay, we gotta get there. If we can't, I'm gonna. Well, what's that? Oh, the temple. We can re we can reheal some people. Problem is, we've lost all our squads. We got that squad left. We could go and heal. Do I want to go for that? So it's turn eight. Um, we do. We got 17 turns to do this. We don't lose if we if it takes more than 17 turns. Um, it just uh, we don't get as rewarded. Move him up there, and if we can res those people, it'd be nice. Yeah, I, I, I like that too. I'm not, I'm not a fan of, like, game over if you don't get enough turns done. I'm not a fan of that. Unless it's like a, you know, unless it's story, sort of a story-driven thing, like you've got to get out of there before everything falls apart. Or, that's, that's okay, but not every mission. Who shot me? You shot me? Can I just go around and hit you next turn? Bet you didn't see this one coming. I have a heal. I keep forgetting to heal that guy. So we have you go there. For my people, for my homeland. Okay. A lot quicker when you only got three squads. Ooh, they're gonna be yeah, that crossbows with shields. Okay. Should we be able to mow these guys down? Mode.
good healer. Now that cavalry squad is nasty. Probably don't even need to fight them. They're fearful. Can we just force them to surrender? Uh, mid chance. There we go. I'm gonna let him him go over there. So I'll just move this guy here for now. Your job is to go over there and, and heal up. And then I, uh, I'm gonna wait. The crossbow, so I don't want to get too close. I think the crossbow's gonna suit three. Hopefully it's just two. I don't know what the rules are that. We're gonna find out. Yep, they can shoot. No, no, maybe not. How absurd this is the great hope of all Viridia. The small child? What has she done to earn Donar's favor? What could she do? Captain Antares is a true lapdog to the very end. Arbalists, destroy him. Arbalists, that's that's what they're talking about. Wow! I love this part. Capture that. Can you uh, can you do your thing now? Revive. Um. Yeah. Can I heal too? No. Okay. Uh, I'll go. No, no, no. We're gonna let the horses go in first because they can get out. How tough is an arbalist against a horse? Not. Back up. I will go clean him up. I actually may have done this in 17 turns. Ooh, the skellies. I like those skeletons. I must stay strong. Is that right? Do I need to? Is that how I need to do this? And Terry's needs to go in there. Okay. Oh yeah, I did faster, but I skipped those uh, those chests. You're right, kiddo. These people are expecting you. All right, then. Thank you for keeping me safe, Captain and Terry's. Join us, Florina. Florina. Welcome to Armitage. Armitage, child of Donar. I'm official of the Donari Temple. We've heard of fierce battles outside this capital. I think Donar, you arrived safely. What do you need me to do? Skull, thanks for hanging out. I hope you have a good one. Nothing, nothing, that is to say, I simply make yourself comfortable here at Armitage. Some acolytes of the Sisterhood of Mercy will tend to your needs. When time comes, just follow along and guide through the process. By the end of the day, you'll very likely will be the sanctioned to be Viridius Empress. What's an Empress do? Oh, there we go. And then we're back, um... We're back... Okay, well, yeah, we're, and we're back over, yeah. Out, out of that one now. Okay. Okay. Army's kind of in shambles at the moment. But Diana would love to have some archers. I'm not sure it's best for you, Diana, but that's what you're going to get. There we go. How much does it take to put those archers in there? You can put... You have eight more you can put in. Stefan can have eight more also. And I can have a bit more too. Okay. Can we uh, can we buy somebody? I got money. I might as well spend buy the good guys. So we have an apprentice here. I'll take a apprentice. We've got Owen the Spearman. Sure. Uh, they may have been too, may be a little too expensive, actually. Let's see how this looks. So, like me. Um, I have enough put 12 in there, so I could put in a, um, no, I cannot. 
Can I put you in? Yeah, the Green Marks can lead squads. Yeah. It's like Franklin in the back there. Not really not really what I I don't I guess it's a nice balanced squad or so, I suppose. Um Diana can have No, it's only eight, so. Actually that's all no good. So let's remove Manuel. And we'll add you. It's kind of a damage deal and not much of a not much of a tanky um, group. Mm, I got that spear guy I want to use. How can I do that? Level, what level are you? Um, let me make this squad. Oh, and we'll lead? Up there. We'll add Manuel. What a great squad. We've got 20 more we can put in there. Get a healer. And we'll get like a militia. See if we can fit them all in there. There we go. Okay. Cool. Alright. Um, I have a couple. I have none of those. Divine Hammer of the Denari. Uh, yes. Plus, yes. Tide Reavers, the Mark is hiding out at Granheim Abbey, and there's a mountain of gold waiting to, reward of, to reward his bounty. I don't care if you burn at the place of ashes. I want Nook's pretty little blue head. Um, oh yeah, I was gonna put some of the more skeleton things on people. I didn't. So we need to get to where we need... Oh, we gotta deploy first. Find and rescue the dragon child. Fort Naxus needs to be sieged. A lot of units on this map. The battle lines of Archers, never I'm gonna stick you in the temple. I don't have a very. I'm not sure I like my squads this time around. We just, I think we just get experience fighting. I want you guys to stand here and hit him with uh, with arrows. You could go all the way back there. Seems kind of a shame to put her in the archer squad because she's such a good tank. She should I should really have, have rearranged this a bit better. Can you guys surrender? No.
Oh, that's a good, a good squad. She should be in that squad. That'd be the perfect one for her. We would, that would be a nasty squad. Abigail here. With, uh, with Diana in it. And then I think maybe Owen could be leading the archers. These are just archer cavalry? Oh, yeah. Get in there. Yeah, they're good and they add up. This squad isn't so, so much. Yeah. They may be dying this turn. I don't know, they're just, they're just archers, I suppose. Horse archers. Go ahead and go for that, or should we just swap this guy and let him kill him? I'm gonna swap. Okay, and we'll let him go do the get the kill. My friends are counting on me. For my people. For my homeland. Repent before the righteous. You can't reach over there. Mm. I must stay strong. He's better defender. You wait there. You wait there. Where am I needed? I don't think they can reach all the way over there. Gold! Or sunstones. Oh, my archer. I'm gonna run like a whole army. Like if I use one of those harder things, whatever. Can I use like, can I do a whole skeleton army? That'd be cool. Oh uh, yeah, let's finish these guys off. Can they just, I don't want them to surrender. I want to, I want their, I want their bones. Nice. I was hoping we'd get a heal on her so she wouldn't die. I was wondering if I so yeah if I but if I could have just me and what four skeletons would it be like rid ridiculously overpowered because every time we kill something we get more we get more skellies also I think maybe every one of my units needs to have one of those so we can keep on getting more skeletons oh I didn't know it was two people in range Man, they got destroyed. My archer squads. I don't know. 
I'm not very good at managing them. Bet you didn't see this one coming. Hit that rogue group. Ah! I thought, I thought, wow, that's a tough group. And they're getting way tougher. <laughs> uh oh. That's no good. Um. Yeah. Feed them. Man. Uh. I don't know. He's gonna die this turn. I think we need to just like, if I stay back, they're gonna hurt. Oh, we do. I go there, I can probably kill two of them. And they kill me and they get more skeletons. I'm gonna go in here. It's a lot of skeletons. They're a lot tougher than I am. I'm not gonna do it. Uh, cancel. Cancel the whole thing. Um. See ya. Look at all those skeletons. Oh, and oh, they're stabbing me in the back. Oh, they survived. Okay, okay. Another Mark of the Risen. I wish we could give those out, just like pass them out like candy. Um, and she was my, my tough squad, and now she's like done for. Um, we just say like, that's a loss, and we just go for the, uh, the victory. I don't think it's going to work. Um, I can't get out that way, because he's blocking me here. I can come in here and hit him, but I think it's just going to end up in, um, in crying. Because those dang skeletons. Target the leader. Yeah. They are fearful. I think I can just uh, force surrender with the chances. Very low. Well, we won't do that. What's the number? 20. And we're actually evenly matched, it says. Let's just hit him. I got him. Okay, no problem. No problem. Shattered. Um, if you stay there, you're gonna die. So what you're gonna do is you can't heal. You're gonna die because he's gonna have me. He's gonna chew on your little face. For my people, for my homeland. Hmm. My friends are counting on me. What else am I gonna do? Can you get him to surrender? Yeah. At least we got some experience. So I can come over here and maybe he'll come to me. I guess we could try that. Um, or I can just say, forget it. I'm gonna go for the end. I could've gone better if I built my armies, my troops better. I, my troops are very poorly done. Like, I think this is, this is a really good squad. I think she could have been a really good squad if I had gotten, what's her face, the paladin in there. Then, I think this could have been a really good squad. And this one, oh, and I don't know what to do with Owen. I don't have any archers, so I, they're gonna die. Here we go. Okay. 
The archer I had in my squad. He didn't do anything. He just died a bunch. Or quickly. So maybe another another guy with a spear. Might have been nice to have. Another skeleton would have been great. If it's possible to keep stacking skeletons up. I was going for him instead. Yeah, we gotta just stay away from that army. We just, we created a monster. But I got my own monster. Oh my stars. A baby dragon. What a sweet thing. Sweet thing. Yeah, it's scared too. Tide Reavers are probably looking to sell it. The grown-ups go for a king's ransom, you know. No surprise considering the devastation they can bring. Did I find it? Where is it? Diana, take care of Diana's dead. Of course, Sister Abigail. This dragon is a lucky one to have you. That's quite a love bite. A little soft next time. I'll call you Nibbler. Okay. So is the dragon in it says find Find and rescue the dragon child. Okay. Guess we did. I can't really do anything with her. She's just gonna die. Oh, it's in my aunt. What? If only I wasn't like there. Can I maybe run to the town and get a and get a, a big bonus defense? They even have like their skeletons learn how to put armor on. So my I'm thirty eight, they're at forty nine. I got a it's cool that I got a dragon. Too bad I can't heal myself. Um. Oh, hey, wait. I can I can heal, can I? Okay, okay. I'm saved. Maybe. You go there. I'm gonna run over here and heal ya. A few times. I'll heal... You guys. Oh, I have one healer. Oops. Okay, well. That's something. In the trees, maybe we'll get a little bit of defense. We got a dragon. He's gonna die immediately as soon as that skeleton comes in and... <laughs> Look at them all. Oh, man. <laughs> we're gonna be in trouble because we're gonna be stuck there. And they're gonna be coming at us. Wanna? I don't want to fight him. Uh, maybe if I go here, he can't go through the trees very fast. Yeah. You guys, uh, you guys want to be friends? I have a dragon. Oh, he could me. He made it. There's more of them! No, oh, he didn't die. Yet. My healers. Well, I guess I'm, I, I heal a bit. Roast beef of might. <laughs> Makes me want to go to Arby's. Can I run away down here and cross a bridge? No. Are you sure there's nothing I can like put on you? Like, um, maybe I can give give you some some loot of some kind. No. No. All right. I must stay strong. I mean, according to the uh, the old stats, I may win this fight. I could always heal. I should do that. I only have one heal though, but I gotta use it. The problem is I get I get first strike if I attack him. Okay, I gotta heal. Gotta heal this guy. Okay, uh, I can move around, I guess. 
I should stay away from that guy. I'm gonna go hang out in these trees. They seem cozy. <clears throat> huh? Still alive. No arrows. Now. Starting to snow. They are shattered. I would love to heal. I'm just gonna heal. One more heal. Uh, that guy again. Okay. And then... I'm just gonna stay right here. That guy's not moving, so I'm not worried about him. I'm worried about the archers coming in and shooting me, but I'm in the trees, so I get a bonus. Plus, it's snowing now. I think that gives me a bonus. I don't think I can take out these other guys though because I don't have my healer anymore. I mean I have me, but I'm not I'm not like I'm not like her. You can still attack after that heal. I think the bandage thing that I have just gives me more um, uh, capacity. Isn't that what it said? Maybe it does that too. For my people, for my homeland. Temple here, yeah. I must stay strong. I forgot about that. The battle lies before. Yeah, I'm not sure. Pretty sure when you heal, because I tried it before, but it might have been a different unit I was using. Fresh my heels while I'm over here. For my people, for my homeland. <clears throat> right, if I can, can I max like, like heal myself up? I must stay strong. Hang out here for a minute. The battle lies Do one more, one more heal here. Um. Maybe one more. We gotta take out, um, I guess it's these these two guys in front and then big guy. If we get the, get the big guys and we do a good job with the little guys here, if we do a good job, then I can raise more skeletons. Let's do one more heal and get hurt, topped off, and rest. I don't know if I, can if I can heal up my skeletons and put them and get more of them. Can you heal these guys? No. Okay. For 
my people from my homeland. I'm not going to worry about that one. I'm just going to go get these guys down here. I must stay strong. Still fearless. I'm not sure why. I'm pretty scared. You know what? What if I just hang out on this hill? Throw a couple... A couple little shots at this guy. You gonna come at me this time? Oh, he's gonna shoot me. Again, I'll do one more round. One more round of that. Can I say target leader into it? There we go. That's what we needed. Okay. <coughs> the battle lies before me. Okay, now we got the big the big fight. I mean, is it gonna work? I don't know. They got three archers. I think it's better for me to just go in there rather than try to archer them down. I got one down. Hang in there. Okay, that was a little ugly. I think my skeletons are still alive. Ready. I got it. Oh, it's so close! He's at 37. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna raise you as a skeleton, buddy. Hope you don't mind. You shaking surrender? I don't think so. Skeleton. Oh. Okay. Done. In thir uh, only took 31 turns. <laughs> Braze on Nitty's right. I must stay strong. Seize it. Right. Just me and the archer. <clears throat> Rank B. Eh. Man. 
Well, that is a good place to call it a day. There's Symphony of War, the Nephilim Saga, the new Legends DLC. <clears throat> it's been out for a little while, but the DLC came out, I think, yesterday. We get story time? Oh, we find out our buddy? Yeah, permadeath is real, certainly adds up, cranks up the um, difficulty. Because if you, if, you if you have it off default, then um, you can keep on leveling up your guys, you know, but um, I don't know. That doesn't seem right. Hey, scumbag, talking to you, says the prison guard. Hey, yeah, easy there, buddy. He's sleeping. Or something. Have it your way, traitor. You keep not talking, and I'll keep pummeling you. Money. <laughs> Sleep tight. You can't come down here. Oh, we have we arrived. Me and my archer buddy. Barbaric. How long have they let you languish in here? Don't worry, my boy. I know what they did to you. We won't let them get away with it. Who are you? Edmund Pendergast, financier. You heard the name. Yeah, you got some money, they say. What do I, ma what do I matter to a man like you? Just know that I'm a friend, and frankly, you could use one right now. You'll know what you need to know in time. You two, get him out of those chains. A bit dramatic with that whole end of the world speech, don't you think? These two are dead. Look, he's not that familiar with the temple's ways. It may just, maybe just that he, just what he needed to hear. Serious about that stuff, aren't you? Just as the cult was deliberate in finding the Nephilim, so too must the paladins be when countering their actions. Okay. Everything happens for a reason. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. Yeah, yeah, enough of that. Sure, we'll stay right here. Try to revisit the most infamous outlaws the world has ever known. Their first army of mercenaries failed to capture Nook. It's clear that they will be back. Now Nook's army sets up operations from Fort Naxus. Uh, it's only a few days' trip to Port Janos from there, but Nook's army prepares for the wrath of the Tide Reaver army, commanded by the master assassin Kuguda. Alright, what an army we have. I think if I would do this differently, I like my army with me. I might, I might lose the archer, and um, actually, let me check this real quick. If I were to use an item on me, like another one of these, and like another one of these, I think the dragon. No, the dragon's dead. Uh, well, maybe let's, let's yeah, because it's just those. And then in my army, I can add in these fellas. And Chad, Chad the skeleton. And then we could be like, we'd be like super nasty because every time we, we kill something, we get more back. We get him out of here. It'd be real nice. Uh, did you get an upgrade, buddy, Franklin? Anything I can do with you? Make you an archer, a horsebow, a skirmisher, an apprentice, or a crossbowman. Crossbowman might not be a bad idea. Can ambush, get significant skill. Attack him two tiles away, gets a bonus against heavy troops. I can maybe just have him back there with my skellies. Sure. Good job, Franklin. Hey, it's Franklin. Um, and then... I can do it again. Oh, and there's some, some skeleton archers. There's skeleton dudes with shields. Polearm skellies. 
So we could just have like an army of the undead. More bowmen. Last one. Do with big, big, big uh, sword. So then my units. How many do you guys take? They take only eight. Let me move these guys. Let me move these guys around. Shield guy. Uh, Chad, scoot over. Actually, I may get Chad out of there. And we'll put in this guy. Ethrin. And I still have room for another one. Um, not enough. Oh, because it's oh four. Because I guess we have so many of them in here. Um, well, it, well, I don't know. I would say uh, maybe a healer, but maybe a healer wouldn't be best because um, I don't think I can heal them. Maybe that'd be a squad best for someone like Stefan or someone who who doesn't do the healing. Anyway, let's let's call it a day. I think I unlocked a new one of these, didn't I? Yeah, I've got a few of these unlocked now. All right, let's call it a day. Thanks for hanging out tonight. I certainly appreciate that. I'll be here tomorrow, and we'll play a little, probably just play some Master of Magic tomorrow.